I see you gather before me. Geralt had to face Aradin, but could only hope to beat him with the help of friends. The Wild Hunt could be defeated with exceptionally powerful magic, so Triss and Yen set out to reconvene the Lodge of Sorceresses. Avalach, too, began to lay plans of his own. Sure you weren't followed? Yeah. Let's begin. Observe the water's surface carefully. We can't let anything go unnoticed. Graham, et thuir, Robert Nicale, Alfelte. Graham, et thuir, Se Agnes Kerle, Es Pirchena, A Es Kleis. Looks familiar. A bathhouse. I know the place. Dijkstra. He has her. At his bathhouse. Might have guessed as much. Was that the past or the future? The recent past. We have to hurry. Let's go to the bathhouse. Might not be too late. Come on. Hey, Mom. How are you? You have a degenerate space. I hope we get there in time. I hope Dijkstra hasn't already hurt her. The possibilities are many. Could be Dijkstra that got hurt. Not likely. Dijkstra never forgave her for sending assassins after him. And Philip is weakened, no doubt about it. Weakened, maybe. But still a powerful sorceress. If Dijkstra's men take the Dimeridium off, Philippa will kill them before they can say, oh shit. I live on Eastern Way, speak the truth. Uh. Which thing was I gonna swap out? Oh, this one. Watch out! Guess they underestimated Philippa. Surrender! This place is a maze, witch! You'll never get out! Goddamn fools! After her! We'll handle this. Oh no, no, no! The sorceress stays here. We're going together. Not a chance. It's fine, Geralt. I'll stay. In case she tries to flee this way. Fine. Be right back. Where'd she go? Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Philip, wait. I am your master now. You're to protect me, understood? 
Oh no, Bart! We shall no pass your pretty birdie no say. Damn it, cast a spell on him too. She's hurt. Did you see that? I want to help her. Birdie no past go say, but no let past go. <sighs> Ever had a stomach ache? Mm. Ache? Aye. But once old drowner eat. Her stomach aches like she just ate a hundred old drowners. But no want. Drowner make egg very bad. Let me pass. I can help her. Mm. But let past go. Which uh, help? Good. Thank you, Bart. I didn't want to have to hurt you. I want to help you. Help me die. Don't hold your breath. I'm not out to hurt you. Bollocks. Crap. You will not take me. I want to help you. Ha! Forgive me, but I just don't believe you. Great. Gotta be kidding me. Hey, Oscar Khan. Oh, I was using the wrong sword. I'm an idiot. Hey, Flagisalis. What's up, dude? Stop squirming. If I wanted to kill you, you'd be long dead by now. What do you want? To torment me? To watch others do so? I need your help.
betray me, and I will... Relax. Not planning on it. Triss is outside. She'll explain everything. Deepest apologies, but the lady will come with me. Dijkstra, I don't have time for this. Get out of my way. I've no quarrel with you, Geralt, but Phil and I have lots to talk about. Remember the assassins you sent after me, darling Phil? A grave error. Such matters ought to be handled personally, as I will now demonstrate. Not gonna demonstrate a damn thing. I need her. And I don't give a flying fuck. I've awaited this moment forever, so very sorry, but I care as much about your plans as I do about the snows of Mahakam. Philippa will come with me and answer for all the courtesies she's paid me. Always knew the value of information, Dijkstra. Which is why I don't believe you have anything I don't already know. The Emperor of Nilfgaard wasn't able to sway the Trade Corporation. Opposition nibbling at his ass, eh? Hmm. Seems the White Flame won't dance on the graves of his foes much longer. His daughter has returned. The Emperor wants to abdicate, give her the throne. Cyrilla? Impossible. This... This could shift the tide of war. Provided, of course, you're not mistaken. Emperor himself told me. So, information's first hand. Emir's a lying whore. When it comes to his daughter's future, doubt it. You've no idea of the importance of this information. A change on the Imperial throne could bring the war to an end. Radovid's sure to be delighted. If Amir sounds the retreat, there'll be no force left that could possibly stop that madman. Especially in light of our bloody aborted plan. You didn't actually believe you could do it. Radovid's crazy, but he's no idiot. Knows all too well there are dozens out there who'd... Silence. Do I understand you correctly? You want to kill Radovid? <laughs> well, Ziggy, I am impressed. Doubted you still had it in you, frankly. Sadly, as you well know, Radovid has sought refuge on his boat. He's guarded so closely, I'd not be at all surprised to learn he shares his bed each night with two sentries. You know too much, Phil. Yet one more reason why you must die. Think you might want to hear her out. Dare say Philippa despises Radovid at least as much as you do. I'm content someone apart from myself has finally gotten the idea to rid the world of the degenerate. Save your praise for others. I couldn't give a shit. Currently, only two individuals stand to draw Radovid off his boat. Emir and myself. You'd agree to be the bait? I fear you'd be hard-pressed to convince Emir to dangle himself as such. Fat fucking chance. Geralt, I wouldn't trust this cunt to hard-boil my eggs. Rightly so. I'm terrible with eggs. But think on this. Radovid hears that you've captured me. Will he not throw caution to the wind? Will he not jump at the chance to kill me, personally? with his bare hands. Out of the question. Geralt, get her out of here before I burst her testicle. And then, then we must meet with our friends. I've leased a warehouse port side. Be sure to come. Excellent. Sorry to take so long, but I had to deal with the guards. Hello, Triss. Philip, are you all right? I've been better. I'll get you out of here. Gonna be all right? Yeah, thanks for your help. Is, is Siri still in town or did she leave too? Oh, it says she's over at uh, at the building. Okay, maybe I can go do that. All 
I just changed quests because I'm an idiot. Reason of state? Meet Dijkstra, Roach, and Taller in the portside warehouse. Oh, this is the assassination attempt. Okay. Wow, there's so much stuff coming up now. Okay. I was afraid I was going to have to kill Dijkstra there. Hmm. Not that it would have been a problem to do so, just I didn't really want to. Yes, Geralt? Look what I picked up. Artifact compression. Someone got themselves enchanted in this figurine. Intend to decompress? Of course. Whoever cast the spell on the poor soul must have forgotten about him. I think it's a soldier. We'll know soon enough. Come with me. I know a place where the walls don't have ears. Everything's ready. Let's get to work. Place is pretty grim. True. It looks like a vampire's hideout. Which is why we can be pretty sure no one will bother us here. Give me the figurine and stand back. Let's try to decompress this one. Anything I can do to help? Yes. Be quiet and try not to disturb me. That's fair. In Alan Dwana Ar Ice. Verde and the Kelter. Who are you? What am I doing here? As a bond. <laughs> Who are you? What's the last thing you remember? I remember a hill. A battle. I had orders for a unit. I remember a sorceress. Her hair like flames. She cast a spell. The right flank was to attack. Hit the shield bearers. The right flank didn't attack. And the sorceress was Lita Nade, known also as Coral. I was there too. This... this happened long ago. She said it. You're exhausted. Always happens with compression. Get some rest. Yes, I should. Once you've recovered a bit, you should find Ambassador Varatra. He's sure to help. Good luck. That was interesting. And exhausting. Oh, to fall onto a feather bed and sleep till... Well, till I woke. Where the hell am I? Oh, I'm not that far. Okay. So that's Avalach. That's Yennefer. This is Siri. Or we could do the other one, the one to assassinate What's-His-Face. Reason of State. This is killing, um, Radovid. Let's do that. 
sister. Why are your eyes so strange? Why are my eyes so strange? Why are your eyes so strange? Poke! I just poked the kid's eyes out. I should follow where the road says to go. Too much verticality can kind of screw me here. Slap a noon race tits. What a saying. Got right cabbage last night. What will become of us under Sweet thing. Oh, this was clear across town, wasn't it? Goodness. I walk where I want. What's what? Oh, I hit the wrong button. What's left to think about? Shackle the horse, and he was out to murder me. Who's there? Witcher Geralt. Get in here. Boss awaits upstairs. Can you bloody tell us what this is about? Just as soon as Geralt arrives, should he arrive. You are a barren talk. The least you can do is pour around. Bloody suspect. Witcher, at last. Now, we're all present. <sighs> Not up the fucking creek. Why have you summoned us? Radovid's on his ship. We'll not get to him there, I told you. Stop it. I have an idea how to draw him onto dry land. But all in due course. Let's start by confessing our sins. I let Philippa Eilhart in on our plan. Mea culpa. Bravo. Bloody bravo. Now, now. It's not a disaster. The Lady Sorceress is highly unlikely to warn the brat. What's more, she's willing to help us kill him. Naturally, it's nothing I'll ever agree to. But Phil, she's inspired me. Call her my muse. Inspired you to do what? Patience. We've yet to get to the substance of the matter. Geralt, do I recall correctly that Radovid's hired you to find Philippa? Mm -hmm. Only thing I've found is her hideout. What's your point? We can use Philippa without involving her, provided you help. Radovid expects you to report to him. Bring him information about her. All you need to do is mention her name. Intimate that you've a lead. You're on her trail. Oh, he'll swallow that. Hook, line, sinker, and a good bit of the rod as well. Let's say Radovid bites, believes me, and none of that's a given. What then? You'll tell him you've found Philippa's hideout. Somewhere where we can easily set a trap and ambush. Suggestions? Bridge to Temple Isle. Built up both sides. Lots of nooks, gates. Easy to block off from the rest of the city. Good idea. I'll divide my men. Post half on one end, other half on the other, by the gate. And in the middle, Vess, with a well-oiled crossbow. You see, Geralt? All we ask is that you invite Radovid out for a stroll. Bring him to the bridge. We'll take care of the rest. So what'll it be? I'm in. But once it's done, what then? There'll be an uproar in the city. 
Panic, maybe. Need a place where we can wait it out. Thought of that already. Remember Madame Arena's theatre? Abandoned now, not a soul looks in there. Tala and I will await you there. Await us? Unwilling to risk your own necks? Not the point. Deeksra and I have many cocksacking virtues, but fighting ability is just not one of them. About as fit for that as we offer a bleeding beauty pageant. Don't worry, Geralt. My people are battle-hardened. They'll manage. You just bring them the kid. Do what I can. Where's his ship moored these days? Just round the corner, in Novograd's port. And for your sake, I hope he's in a good mood when you look in on him. The bridge must be clear. My lads will make sure of that. Guards round the temple, what about them? Won't they bloody congregate when they see the fighting? If they're paid a tidy sum, they won't. God damn it, Philippa, why are you gonna be watching like that? Philippa? What the hell are you doing here? Geralt, don't ask questions you know the answers to. It makes you look stupid. Eavesdropping on your conversation, naturally. With a good deal of interest. And a measure of wonder. Mind telling me what you found puzzling? Your naivety. Do you honestly believe Radovid will fall for such a crude ruse? Radovid's lost his mind. Doesn't think rationally anymore. That's why. That is why he may very well choose to torture you, even if you brought me to him in chains. Just because. Philippa, uh, why even tell me this? Concerned about me that much? Not at all. It's because I think it vital that Radovid die. You don't want my help, more's the pity. But I shall do what I can to make certain you don't fuck it up. Here, take this. A ring. Redanian eagle etched in the ruby. It belonged to Vizimir, Radovid's father. Hand him that, and he may believe you captured me. He might even choose to trust you. What's the catch? There is none. Philippa, I know you too damn well. Always got a plan. Always got at least two irons in the fire. This time I shall be content with one. Radovid's head planted at its end. Good luck, Geralt. You'll need it. Her owl is always so slow. All right, what the hell is this? Are you looking at me cross-eyed, gray boy. What's the problem? Fuck! Another non-human. You're everywhere. Silence. Now we'll do this quick. I've got a little witcher chore. You're willing? Little chores aren't usually worth the pay. Well, this will be, don't you, Fred? Now, just be quick about it. I've wasted enough time on these two pricks. They share a warehouse. Monsters cropped up in it. Cropped up? On its own? You put it there. You meant it to rip my noodle off so you could get your paws on my goods. Don't try to spin this, shorty. I don't care who sick the ghoul or the strigger on who. Beast's got to be dealt with. That's that. So what'll it be, would ya? Fine. I'll see to it. I'll not have it. Non-humans, they stick together. These two are like to prove it's no ghoul at all, but my dear departed Nan. I didn't get a good look at the mug, but now you mention it, it could very well be. Shut it, or I'll <laughs> send inspectors to your storehouse just as soon as the monster's dispatched. That won't be necessary. Yeah, I didn't think so. Oof. Well, the warehouse is right here. Well, shoot, why not? Really? Just a single necker. Well. Did it. Strange. Neckers rarely venture anywhere alone. You take care of the beast? Yes. I knew Iron Witch would be quickest, so figure out how it got in there. You hired me to kill the beast, not investigate. 
Well, oh, fair enough. It's just I'll still have to muck around in the matter. Would have paid extra not to. Here, this is for you. And we'll go to the garrison, talk to the captain. He can try to get to the bottom of this. It's fine by me. That's all I really care about. <laughs> Lure Radovid from his ship. Oh, he's not far at all. Okay. Up higher. Shit. Beat you, freak it, bitch. Ah! What are you doing? Up, please. Up, 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 up. What are you doing? Oh my god. Stay on the surface. Thank you. Death on three pounds of steel. It's a waste of words. God, foolproof. Witcher Geralt, what do you want? An audience. Got new information about Philippa Eilhart. I'll need your weapons. Now follow me. Your Majesty, the Witcher, with news of Philippa Eilhart. I hope you brought something better than magic crystals this time. I know where she is. Perhaps. Or perhaps you seek to trick me, like the others. What others? Uh, you see, a rumor went around that I'd generously reward any who bring information about Isleheart. There's no shortage of the greedy and the stupid. So a queue quickly formed at the gangway to the ship. The first aboard was a hunter. Brought me a dead owl with no eyes. He thought I'd believe it, shower him with gold. I had him blinded, then thrown overboard with a stone tied round his neck. The second was the postmaster from Oxenfurt. Claimed to have a letter she'd penned. It was forged, of course. I had his fingers cut off. He'll never write again. Oh. And I took his tongue. The spoken lie is just as reprehensible. Needless to say, the rest of the queue dispersed quickly. I'm a professional. Got a reputation to uphold. Be stupid of me to come to you empty-handed. My father's ring. Philippa used it to stamp her decrees, then distribute them as the word of the king. Where is she? Under your nose, sire. In Novigrad, in a house on the bridge leading to Temple Isle. Why haven't you brought her to me? Gotta capture someone to take them anywhere. All I did was track her down, then stole this ring as proof that I had. Do you fear her? No. You want to kill her yourself, with your own hands. I know this. You shall come with me. Hubrecht, gather the men. How many, sire? All of them.
Well, where is she? Where is Philippa? Like I said, house on the bridge, closer to the other end. Close off this end. We need no guests, no innocent bystanders, or witnesses. Damian, Duke, Egbert, Freak, Kaspar. You shall stay here, secure the rear, and kill the Witcher. You don't know where Philip is hiding. Not exactly without me. Fret not. We'll manage. Naturally, it would be easier with your help, but you irritate me. You know too much. You impede me too often. And I find your arrogance an annoyance. I've had men killed for less. Follow me. Good luck. Any last words? Oh, fuck! Free the Witcher, then Radovid! Oh, that's right, I don't have my sword. Get to Radovid before reinforcements arrive. Now I have my sword. Open up! I command you to open the door! You needed merely to ask. That settles the score. And that was from the heart. Forgive me. I could not deny myself the pleasure. How did she... Where? Why? How the fuck? Eve's dropped on us, back at the warehouse. What? And you didn't think it worth mentioning? Lads, the time to discuss this is later. Radovid is dead. It matters not by whose hand. Mission accomplished. Now let's get the hell away. Place will be thick with Redanians in minutes. Let's go. Well, what? 
Is it done? It's done. The wall did not go according to plan. More on that later. First a stiff drink and a toast. The North. Tamaria. Tamaria! Bloody Tamaria! Sure this isn't premature. Radovid's dead, but it's a long way from that to a free Tamaria. War's not over, not even close. You're mistaken. Tomorrow at noon, the commander of Army Group Center will sign a truce in Amir's name. A truce whose wording we agreed with Dijkstra. So back there in Velen, when the trolls nabbed you? Yes, I was returning from the last round of talks. Amir will keep Edion and Lyria, but in exchange for Radovich Ed and a stop to guerrilla activities, he will withdraw from Tamaria. Which will become the Empire's vassal state. Self-ruled internally, with its own courts, administrative structures and army. The silver lilies will bloom neath the rays of the great sun. So I say were I a poet. But I'm not, so all I'll say is there was no other fucking way. haven't told me the whole truth. You're right on that account. We know you're bloody allergic to politics, decided to emphasize mages and whatnot. If it were done when tis done, then twere well it were done quickly. That but this blow might be the be-all and end-all here. What's that? Vakmeth, Act 1, Scene 7. Always wanted to play that. Never cast as anything but a halberdier. Geralt, what Tala told you, put it out of your mind. There will be no truce with Nilfgaard. Redania, under my enlightened rule, will fight on until it wins. And when it does, it will unite all the North, including Temeria. What? Ow! This is not what we plow and agreed. True. Instead, we insisted on one realm's questionable sovereignty, and to recover it, we gave Amir virtually all the North's other kingdoms. It was not a wise arrangement. So, no deal. You two-faced horseman. I will not allow this. Actually, you, Roach, should be the first to understand I've no choice. Why the hell would I understand? Because you too are a patriot. Geralt, this doesn't concern you. You may go. Fare thee well on your path, or what not. Can't let you kill them, Dijkstra. Oh, hard luck. Then you'll die with them. Kill them all. You think they'd learn by now that I'm not an easy man to kill. Hey, Dijkstra. Bloody hell! Bugger me sideways! That was close. Very close. It's hardly over. The envoy, due to meet the Nilfgaardians tomorrow. No doubt Dijkstra ordered him killed. We'll need to protect him. Sorry, you're on your own, I've... You've had your fill of politics, I understand. Once it's over, come to Vizima. You'll be received with honors. Farewell, Wolf. Oh yeah, I do want to go in there. The extra had a ham sandwich.
Okay, so that's it for quests, right? Yes. All right. Uh, I'm going to wait for daylight. I'm going to do series thing first. I want to make sure... I got a new achievement! Assassin of Kings! <laughs> Fitting. Your kind spreads disease. If I'm limited on who I can help, I want to help Siri, and then I'll help Yennefer, and then I'll end with Avalok. Just in case the game's like, you can only do three. I'm like, well, Elf is last. something in particular? Um, a pretty little trinket. Want to give someone a present? When I was last in Novigrad, I had my share of troubles. So I heard. A few people helped me then. Others, not so much. Now I mean to repay them both. Coming with? Lead the way. We need to go to Temple Isle. Don't remember you being religious? Nor am I now. Let's go. Almost there. Where are we going exactly? To see Horson Jr. Bit late for that. He's dead. I asked Sultan. And he said Horson's alive and well on Temple Isle. I was there. Stuck a sword in his gut. Your hand must have slipped. Because it seems he's recovered. What the shit? Why are you doing this again? I want to look him in the eyes. What then? I don't know. Depends what I see. Right. Oh. Oh. What? Here to see Mr. Wiley. Mr. Wiley's expecting important guests. So bugger off, you... you... Turds! Make a deal, maybe? Uh... Yeah... Yeah... A deal. Go on upstairs. Boss is waiting. Thank you. Very pleasant. Strange. To say the least. I wonder what they're doing. We'll know soon enough. Do we have here? Finally found your little ward. Took your sweet fucking time. Seems in fine health to me. Ah, because you thought you killed me that time. Surprise the fucking prize. Shut your trap, witch! Before somebody fills that hole for you. Enough! I'll finish what you started. Whoa, whoa, stop! It's me, Dudu, Dudu Bieberfeld. You really didn't recognize me? Do do. Wait, Siri. After the heist, after Dijkstra's vault was emptied, you vanished. How'd I find you? Quick. Butcher's yard. The mama's plate. Priscilla's. You dragged me onto the stage. Sheathe your sword, Siri. It's do do. God, you give me quite the scare. Not wise to play games with a witcher. Horson Jr. Was there no one else you could impersonate? Once we'd fled, I'd no idea what to do. I could only hide for so long. They'd find me sooner or later. It wasn't our decision. We knew he was dead, but not many others had caught on. That was my chance. No one mourned for Horson Jr. In all his miserable life, he'd never helped a soul. Amusingly, once dead, he became a useful member of society. 
They say everyone deserves a second chance. Seems true enough. Orson got his, in a way, sharing it with a Doppler named Dudu. That was courageous, Dudu. I'd never expect it from you. Neither would I. Oh, by the way, you've no idea at the relief I feel you're alive and well. And I'm relieved I didn't slit your throat. Be careful. You could get found out. Wily's men are too stupid to catch on. His colleagues ain't much better. Mind you, even you were fooled. And that might have ended very badly for you. True. I get a bit carried away at times. But mostly I'm careful. Chose an interesting line of business. Dudu's always had a head for numbers. What's a few brothels and casinos? He'll manage. That's the thing. I don't need to. Two weeks after Wiley died, I announced I'd seen the light of the eternal fire. Sold all the illegal enterprises. I'm a blue water trader now. Horson's men didn't protest? I've contacts in the guilds. Run a thriving trade. Profits are twice what they were before. To Wiley's men, a purse twice as heavy means twice as much respect for the men handing it to them. Time's up. Right. We must still go by the Golden Sturgeon. It was nice to see you both. And take care of yourselves. You too. So long, Dudu. His name means poop. <laughs> Why are we going to the Sturgeon? To see a girl who helped me once. Who might that be? Friends of Dandelions. Her name's B. She's a waitress at the Golden Sturgeon. Help me contact Dandelion. I wish to thank her. She risked a lot. Risked a lot? How's that? The Temple Guard were breathing down my neck. If she'd been seen with me, she might have been flogged or worse. Always getting into trouble. I take after you. Yes, my neighbor Wench sold ambulance to her. Ah. 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 Pardon me. Ah. 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 Fuck. I visited a city once that was very much like Novigrad, but the people there were much taller and had dark skin. This somewhere in Zeracania? No, in another world. Hmm. What's it like, hopping between worlds? Anything like passing through a portal? Or different? Hmm, a bit different. It was hard going at first. I wasn't very good at controlling it, so I had to concentrate intensely and hope I didn't land in the crater of an active volcano. The training I did with Avalok was very helpful. Now, I merely think of the place I wish to travel to, close my eyes, and it's done. Hold on, Siri. Top notch swords. Show me what you have in stock. All right, perfect. Thank you. So long. Thirty seven of those bolts. There's my infinity bolts. All right, cool. We're good. All right, sorry about that. What's the rush? Chance. 
should have taken it. I spit on anything you give me. You'll regret that, you cow. Mind your manners, you're talking to a lady. Stay out of this. This is not your concern. Sure it is. You're a fucking freak too. He is. Very dangerous at that. The butcher of White Orchard. What'd he do there? Trim the trees? Yugen. He slew half the village. Dragged the bodies of the alderman and his wife behind his horse to Novigrad. Let's get out of here. That's pretty good advice your friend's offering. S sorry <laughs> Thank you. I seem more determined this time. You shouldn't cross them, I told you. I'm to bar non-humans from this establishment because some thugs threaten me. Not likely. It's so good to see you, B. And you, Siri. Who's your charming companion? Geralt of Rivia. <gasps> that Geralt! <laughs> Very nice to meet you. I've heard so much. Really? What, for example? For example, how you've saved her from woes so many times she's lost count. And how you always know how to make her laugh. That's Siri, of course. Other ladies, however. B, I'm standing right here. <laughs> all right, all right. So, what brings you here, darlings? I wanted to thank you for everything. Oh, stop. Anyone would have done the same in my shoes. Not many would have done it with such courage. Thank you. This is for you. A trinket to remember me by. Oh, my. It's beautiful. Thank you. So, will you stay for Stew and keep Slaughter to Piglet this morning? Thanks. But we must still visit Far Corners. Ah, off to see Valdo, eh? Well, shan't stop you then. They'll feed you properly there too, no doubt. Farewell to you both. And do take care of our Witcher. I will. So long. So, your friend, B. What about her? Nothing. Seems nice. Geralt, you're terrible. what I say? What's there to see in far corners? The camp of some traveling circus performers. Non-humans. When I came here before, I wanted to contact Triss. Life was hard. I quickly spent nearly everything the Baron gave me. Triss and I never met, because the temple guard showed up. I was a wanted woman afterwards. Triss didn't try to contact you? How could she? She didn't know anything. In fact, she thought she was to meet another alchemist wanting to flee Novigrad. I preferred not to put her in danger. I was being hunted. I had not a copy to my name. Then I met Valda. He and his troop helped me. Then introduced me to B. And through B, I found Dandelion. You know the rest. Where's this friend of yours? Siri, you devil incarnate, where have you been? Come here, darling. Hello? What's this? Brought your granddad? Agar, you're incorrigible. Allow me to introduce Geralt of Rivia. Ah, greetings. We've heard heaps about you. Likewise, and thanks for helping Siri. Oh, we had no choice. Found it hard to refuse a lass like her. Well, good you're here. Come in the nick of time. We'd have been gone by tomorrow. You're leaving? Better start resettling non-humans shortly. We'd rather stay ahead of events. I understand. Problem is, we just lost two horses, and another two are too weak to haul anything. Ah, we'll manage somehow. We don't leave till tomorrow, so naught to worry about today. Yes, for some. I'm off to see a merchant. There's a chance I can trade our knacks for a healthy horse. Wouldn't want Valdo to have anything to worry about tomorrow. What's eating him? Oh, don't worry. 
That's just how Agar is. Be back to his jolly old self by evening. What brings you here? I've come to apologize. I disappeared so suddenly, then... Ah, oh, pish posh. What matters is you're back, and you're well. This is for you. All that you loan me, plus a small premium. Siri, you know I can't take this. And you know I shan't let you refuse. Hmm. I know. We'll make it the pot for a wager. <laughs> Do you still race? Of course. Then I challenge you. Geralt, will you join us? Gladly. A man after my own spirit. <laughs> Come. Geralt, choose one of these. Coming, coming. Holy cow, he's fast. Not very. You were faster once, giving you a head start. Hard to see when it's raining. Faster, you're trailing. Watch where you're going or you'll fall. <laughs> Seems you've slowed. Just want to admire you from the side. <laughs> 